All right, guys, today we're going to be ranking Duel Link's hand traps. As you can see, there's not that many of them, so we won't have too much to go through. But in this meta currently that we're in, we're going to rank it based on that. So first off, uh, I'm going to go with the worst one, I think, is going to be the Emperor's Staff. This is mainly a stall one. Uh, and it's not even that good because it's only on direct attack. It negates one attack, whereas uh, some other ones negate the others. Uh, for C tier, I'm gonna. Or I'm also probably gonna put Drone Lockbird. It could be better. Uh, I haven't. Maybe mainly I've never seen anyone ever droll someone. But I'm sure it's probably better. If just people don't run it, or maybe it's just not good in Duel Links format. Who knows? To be honest, maybe we'll see more of it in the future. But for now, that's gonna be the D tier. I think for the C tier. Uh, we're going to put in the Damage Negators. These could, I think, be decent along the lines of um, they stop attack, or they stop damage calc, uh, or damage from, like, any attacks. I'm thinking, like, specifically, like, in Sacred Beast, these could be good because you have, like, a zero attack point monster on the field, and that's, like, a way to stop, like, a lethal 4,000 damage attack. I'm also going to put in um, Valkyrius in the C tier, mainly because it's only can be used in with other Necros, so you get to play other Necros cards to play this. If it was just based on its ability, it would probably be up there. Now if we go to B, Kiteroid, probably the best stall hand trap for sure. It can negate two attacks, two direct attacks, really really good. And now we have the Bane for hand traps in the game. I'm going to put Lancey in A tier. Um, Lancey is really good. It, it's no longer searchable by like uh, agents. Rockets can still search it. So, and it can be searched with Card of the Soul, I believe is what it's called. Uh, so it, 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 it's searchable somewhat. Um, but a lot of decks aren't banishing now as much as they were before, with the new decks being introduced with like Unchained and uh, I mean, it's decent, it's decent. It can still be used versus a lot of decks. Like, but like other decks like Blue Eyes, Unchained, well, this card will be pretty useless versus them. Uh, Veiler, I'm also going to put in the A tier. This is actually, actually, you know what? I'm going to put Veiler in the S tier. Um, mm, it's really close, it's really close. I, I think Veiler and Skullmeister in the S tier are really good. Skullmeister, it's free to play, that boosts up its value. Uh, make sure you guys get this card, it's in the card trade. If you don't have this card, what are you doing? Free to play, go get it, regular inventory. It's the best, uh, one of the best, if not the best hand trap. And Crow, uh, I think it could be either, honestly, these three are the best hand traps. Uh, it's just a matter of what order they go. Um, so yeah, this is going to be the hand trap tier list. Let me know what you guys think. If you guys agree or disagree with any, or if I missed any hand traps, well, let me know.